only half of businesses have a rigorous cybersecurity plan as of 2022. An additional 30% of businesses admit that they do not currently have a cybersecurity plan, but intend to create one. The remaining 20% don't have a plan and do not intend to create one in the near future. Why are all of these numbers significant? Since only half of businesses have a cybersecurity plan, the other half are at a high risk of experiencing a ransomware attack. Hi everyone, I'm Albert from eTactics, and I'm going to go over the basic statistics behind ransomware. Before we get started, make sure that you subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking the button below. Also, hit that alert bell icon so that when we post new helpful content, you get notified. If you work in an industry that deals with electronic data, you've probably heard about the horrors surrounding ransomware. This type of attack leads to a loss of data, potentially losing a few million dollars and the ability to continue business operations. But what exactly is ransomware? Ransomware is a specific type of malware. It may or may not involve encrypting a victim's data. Many organizations can find themselves locked out of their own computer network. Once the malware has infected an organization's electronic systems, the bad actors will ask their victims to pay them often in the form of cryptocurrency since it's harder to trace back to the illegal activity. Once paid, the bad actors promise to unlock the computers or decrypt the stolen data. The 2020 pandemic caused major disruptions in the supply chains, business operations, and security measures of businesses worldwide. They experienced a 25% increase in ransomware attacks during the 2020 pandemic. 26% of companies in the U.S. reported an increase in ransomware attacks during COVID-19. Remote work and hybrid arrangements force businesses to reevaluate their cybersecurity measures. This location shift led to a shocking increase in cybersecurity incidents. More specifically, the work from home environment led to significant changes in ransomware attacks. You see, 37% of organizations and companies endured a ransomware attack in 2021, and yet there were 50% more cyber attack attempts per week on companies globally in 2021 compared to 2020. Businesses of all sizes must understand the ransomware landscape. If you and your coworkers take the time to understand how ransomware attacks happen, you can take the necessary steps to protect your company. Third-party breaches represented only 1% of the 2021 set. Even so, roughly 40% of the third-party breaches involved ransomware. Making sure your suppliers take the proper security measures is vital for the protection of your data. Internal audits and training can also make a big difference. Roughly 75% of breaches in 2020 happened because of privilege abuse. The next main reason why breaches occur is data mishandling. This includes social attacks, errors, and misuse. 82% of breaches in 2021 involve some form of human element. Therefore, training can help decrease the chance of your employees causing a breach. 35% of ransomware attacks involve some form of email usage. Hackers love to use ransomware attacks because for them, it's a lucrative form of illegal activity. The bad actors know companies can't afford to lose their sensitive information or deal with long bouts of downtime. Since you're bound to experience a ransomware attack in the next few years, you should update your incident response plan. If you'd like to learn more about malware and how to prevent cybersecurity attacks, reach out to eTactics. And since you've already made it this far into the video, you might as well like it, share it, and comment below.